G'day guys, it's Ben here to bring you another video. This one is going to be looking at how we tie a sheep shank knot. Okay guys, so the sheep shank knot, um, this is a really good knot to have when you're, you're wanting to reduce the size of a rope for a particular reason. It's not uh, for critical load bearing or anything like that, but this is a really good knot to, have, to know. So basically, we're just going to um, reduce the size of our, our rope like so. So that's step one. Step two is we're going to form a half hitch. Okay, so all we're doing is we're, we're creating a simple loop that goes over this loop. And we do the same on the other side. Oops, I think I've got my, my This nylon line that I'm using is a little bit slippy, but um, that's okay. Righty. An important thing here is to introduce the load slowly. So, as I said, this is a nylon line, so it, it doesn't hold um, tension in the same way that some of the fibrous ropes would, but um, it's really good. For, uh, for demonstrating this so and obviously without any kind of load on it then the knot can actually loosen so this is as I said before not for critical load bearing but um, it's a very functional knot to know um, when you just simply want to reduce the size of things like guy lines around tents and stuff like that there we go well thank you for watching I hope you've enjoyed this video if you have please press the like button Please feel free to share this video on your favourite social media sites such as Facebook or Twitter or Pinterest. If you have any comments or suggestions or queries, please leave a note below. Please tell me what kind of projects you might be interested in and I can try and get into that in the next couple of months. Uh, I'd love to hear back from you. You can either leave a message below or you can drop me a message through the YouTube system. Please subscribe to this channel for uh, updates on the new videos that are coming out and also um, to know, you know uh, what videos might be coming out that you might be interested in. I'm in sunny Australia here and I'd love to know where you guys are watching this video from. I've seen comments and uh, from, from my subscribers from uh, North America, from the Middle East, from Asia, Africa, Western Europe, Eastern Europe, all around the Pacific and I'd love to know where you're watching this video from. This is the Urban Hobby Farm. We're looking forward to seeing you in our next video. Until then, keep safe.